देखिए अगर आपने फिल्म पठान देखी है या नहीं भी देखी है आई एम श्योर आपने उसका प्रोमो उसका टीजर जरूर देखा होगा और उसमें आपको उसका एक्शन उसके डांस सीक्वेंस उसका ग्रेविटी डिफाइंग एक्शन सब कुछ पसंद आया होगा क्योंकि ये जो फिल्म है ना ये दर्शकों के लिए एक विजुअल ट्रीट है और आज पंजाब के सी नवोदय टाइम्स में हमारे साथ है वो जिन्होंने इन सारी चीजों को फ्रेम किया है यानी कि सचित तो इनसे हम ऑफकोर्स बहुत सारी बातें करेंगे बट फर्स्ट थिंग्स फर्स्ट सचित तो वॉम वेलकम टू यू ऑन आर प्लेटफॉर्म Thank you so much, Sidi, for having me. Great to be here. Yeah, but please tell me, how does it feel post this amazing success of the film? Has it sunk in yet? So I think the first two days of the release, that's when I knew something was going on. A lot of my colleagues, my uh, friends from school, teachers, and all the people who have like uh, helped me in my cinematography, you know, they start reacting. And also the reactions of the people. uh you know waiting in line outside the cinema house that was quite overwhelming i would say right but did you expect like when you became a part of pathan us waqt the expectation thi that it's going to do phenomenally good break so many records uh so it had all the ingredients in it that was required for this kind of uh, a release it and siddhat had mounted it very well you know there was a lot of action a lot of very good location so i mean it was kind of expected i mean technically but the what actually when it actually happened that's when it i realized but but to begin with the film was really planned so well and you know it had so many things going right 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 so um you know initial uh, to the release uh, there was a lot of uh, you know a news that ye record bhi break ho gaya ye record bhi break ho gaya and of course now that buzz is not that much but of course the film is still such a huge success so what kind of comments compliments have you been getting and which one is the best so far that you remember so there's there's uh, there are a couple of magazines in kerala which did an interview where i'm from and there uh, there it was quite special to uh, you know i mean it, it 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 again was a little overwhelming where many of the relatives and people they were very excited about the film cuz people love the film out there and uh, and from where i am in ernakulam there was a little write up about my dad and me and that would turn out to be quite special you know unexpected and uh, yeah and then in addition many uh, many of uh, many other cinematographers in the industry also messaged me and you know congratulated me on the film and say said that they liked what i'd done so that was quite encouraging right and how did you become the part of this film pathan how did that happen so um, the world of bollywood is very new to me this is my first film and um, i i was i'm more familiar with my with advertising work and that's where i come from and in the advertising world uh, a lot of my work was automobile i enjoyed shooting cars and bikes and some of the commercials also were like mini films in in the way they were presented and i think that kind of led me to this film so the advertising work kind of uh, just me and also the films that came my way this one had the genre that i you know kind of uh, wanted to engage with so i guess yeah just uh, it just let let me right and like you said that uh, mostly you've been uh, so far doing ads and when mm-hmm. you got to be a part of a film as big as i mean of course we didn't know back then kitni success ho jayegi but the names that are behind the film are big mm-hmm. right so right. what was your first reaction when you got to know that you know you're going to be a part of pathan so i'd say more than the actors there were there was a script which i knew that okay there's an action film there's going to be a car chase a bike chase and this action beat on, on this and this and this will lead to that those were things that i knew i could engage with and the initial conversations i had with with siddharth i was like okay see you seen my work there's going to be this kind of texture and this this will happen is like yeah sure and then uh once we started um I realized he'll enjoy shooting fast, and I love to shoot fast as well. So there was a great uh, uh, relationship formed, I, I believe, slowly with Siddharth. And then the actors, of course, were fantastic. They made it so comfortable, and uh, they were like uh, very encouraging, and all all great energies on set. I'd say, yeah. Right, right. So how does it feel as a cinematographer? Because you know you have. one is uh, uh, the feedback or the pointers that you get from the director that i want this then one is your own perception ke you know mujhe scene aise banana hai i want this location i want this angle 
and mm-hmm. how does it feel as a cinematographer when the action that you are wanting to catch or the frame that you are trying to portray on camera for maybe action sequence maybe a dance sequence when the actors perform it to perfection how does that feel oh it's an absolute treat uh, for example if, if, if srk has amazing uh, muscle memory and uh, coordination he enjoys the action choreography and when he enjoys it you just enjoy it back because you know he's doing it so well and he understands where the camera is and he's very uh, inclined to orienting his body and favoring things that help uh, help me so many times uh, we would do handheld you know operation for action exact uh, specifically you know in order to find the sweet spot to present the viewer in the middle of the action you need to move the camera at the right time and catch the punch or a kick you know and if i was and he would be a very aware of it so i was trying to lean in somewhere extra he would lean in the opposite way to make sure that i see him you know so, so i was i call it i always refer to it as a dance as a dance with the actor and the camera so it was an absolute treat you know be it standing in for his focus mark or leaning forward to catch the light better when i'm lit in this spot and here there's no light he would he would do it he, he just loved it you know all the actors i mean they were just so fantastic right right so is there or are there any uh, special scenes or special moments that now you recall which um, maybe are your best uh i so i wanted to experiment with colors a lot like uh, you know the virus i wanted to associate red the color red with that and you know even when the virus the effects of the virus are felt you bring back that red and let many of the situations allowed for these kind of uh, things to happen where i could experiment a little bit with with uh, lighting and you know having some mixed color temperatures so i think all of that worked out quite well i mean the production design also is great and rajada was very collaborative and letting me put the lights i wanted to put you know in uh, in many places in the set itself i wanted to have the lights built in so i knew i could dim it up and down depending on what we're shooting so to see all that translate into a film was is a great feeling right so one is that when you were framing your shots and the kind of light you wanted the kind of colors you wanted so when we you know as audience go to the cinema so when we come back we have maybe a favorite song maybe a favorite scene mm. even when i talk to actors and they tell me no no mera ye wala pehla you know ye favorite scene tha so when you were watching the movie the whole edited version when you were watching mm-hmm. that um and of course you were seeing your work there on the big screen were there some bits where you said wow here i've done wonders <laughs> yeah i would say pathan intro like the first time uh, srk is captured and then he comes out and then he this is action beat till he escapes in the chopper no so there i think there were like right decisions made in terms of the color the little bit of green you know, that i added just helps that little bit of blood on him to stand out better and uh, i truly enjoyed uh, you know shooting that bit it was from the moment when you see him for the first time when he comes out of the shadow you know since Sid- that wanted to build that moment up so you would see a little bit of his teeth till really tight shot of his eyes and then slowly he comes out and, he's, and you see him in in full glory and then he just goes for it and then the background music also when i saw it on the screen i was like yeah this is cool you know what sanchit had done and the way it just came together it uh, it was quite rewarding this, especially right. that sequence yeah right like, and puri film you know as i said earlier it's a visual treat to watch you know of course the story and how everything is else has come up but when you see the movie it's like a visual treat whether action sequence whether the dance numbers so what kind of recce did you do to pick the perfect locations and where all has it been shot so uh, lo- all the locations siddharth selected and he knew exactly where he wanted to uh, you know do the songs and uh, shoot some of the sequences so there was, there was siberia there was dubai there was uh, spain you know a bunch of other places uh so to siddha to select these places and post that i would go there and you know and it, since it was so good and the actors were looking so good my work was very easy you know i you just point on the camera around of course the planning was there there was a lot of planning and uh, wire up just beautifully planned out the entire schedule i was at uh, it was it was an absolute treat right and thank you for giving us that absolute treat but however you know such as you saying this is your debut film but the work that you have put forward you know it speaks otherwise so mushkil hai ye manna ki ye pehli film hai aapki thank you thank you so much yeah it is uh, it's great i'm happy 
<laughs> right and uh, what is this journey been when did you decide ke i want to be behind the camera and you know become a cinematographer um so i did a lot of studying uh, i my graduation i graduated in architecture post that i went to the national institute of design in ahmedabad for a visual communication then i went to the film institute to study cinematography so somewhere in and music was a serious hobby all, all along so somewhere i found that uh, collaborating with a director and find be finding uh, a visual way to tell a story was what engaged uh, what what i found most interesting and um, even if i was doing my college projects for myself i would prefer shooting it myself so there it's and i would shoot for others also so there itself it started uh, and at the film institute i think i really like uh, uh, the place is fantastic there's so many great minds uh, you you come across and uh, very interesting people and you're exposed to amazing and uh, uh, indian classic cinema and there's so many things so much of learning so i was fortunate enough to be at these places and uh, eventually i think found my way to uh, being a cinematographer right but how different is uh, the format of advertisement where you have to ultimately record for a maybe 30 second or 1 minute ad yeah. and shooting a full fledged uh, film so in an ad you're very precise there's there's a client who wants something very specific and you know there are certain mandates and this and those and don't but a lot of attention is paid to detail in the ads which is which is great in, in a in a film there's i mean there is a lot more freedom i'd say in terms of what i can do as a cinematographer you know in terms of mood and color and also there's it's more interesting because there is a narrative a strong story that is guiding you you know and you bring your a uh, subjective truth to that when you present it so it's a lot more engaging and to do it consistently over a period of time that is a challenge and uh, and it was an absolute treat you know with wireup and adi sir being this solid pillar of support throughout and the collaboration with sid which kind of grew and an actors being such great people you know and said this is a good nice promo right so are we going to see you any soon uh, doing more uh bollywood or doing more films whether even it's regional so i am uh, doing siddharth's next film uh called fighter and uh, looking forward to that it's very different uh but it's uh, it's there and it just felt like you know uh right thing to do and the right place to be right so we are waiting for the magic to recreate in fighter as well uh, and i'm also waiting with, for this opportunity to interview you very soon again for all your future works and for this interview such a thank you so much and wishing you all the best for future my absolute pleasure thank you thank you bye bye